Welcome to the Micklin Law Group's Tip of the Day. This is Attorney Brad Micklin. Today is February 15, 2017. Today's tip is a second part to a tip I did yesterday that states that fault is not generally relevant in a divorce case. What I said is that it's generally not relevant to issues of divorcing or equitable distribution, but there is a caveat to that. Fault can be relevant to the grounds that you're seeking to divorce, although most commonly people are filing for reconcilable differences these, these days, which is why fault's not so relevant in that issue. It can technically also be used by the judge for equitable distribution to determine if fault should affect it in one way or another. The reason why I said yesterday that it's generally not utilized is because I think there needs to be like a causal connection or something that establishes that the fault actually led to some kind of diminution in the value of your assets for it to be considered. So in my general experience, although the statutes allow for it, they're not generally utilized. For more information on this topic as well as others, feel free to go to our website at www.micklinlawgroup.com. Thank you.